Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma Review. So guys, I've been doing a bit of marathon filming and this is the last film of the night. It is half past 11 at night, very, very late, very, very cold. So I'm just going to get straight into it. So this is a small independent business shout out, one that I've already done before. The amazing guy sent me an item to say thank you for doing the review that I did and I've got to tell you that I'm absolutely honoured when that happens. Um, Gemma Craft Studio, she also sent me um, some prints and I will be doing Gemma Craft Craft again in um, the next upcoming few weeks. Um, and I'm just absolutely honoured. So thank you to Marcus Jones, which is Marcus Jones Art which is what we're going to be doing today. So guys, I actually did buy another print also from Marcus Jones and I actually bought some as a gift. Um, and I did say that I wanted them gift wrapped. So I'm not too sure I'll be able to open them because they are gift wrapped, but if there's a way of me opening them for you to see, I will do. So Marcus Jones art is um, a dark illustrator who is absolutely amazing at what he does. I have featured him before. If you want to see that video, I will pop it up in the eye here so you get to see. And um, absolutely amazing. They were the four postcards that I did. I've actually got one over at the desk here. But I'm going to show you one of the prints that I got first. So guys, they come in this tube, which, you know, I was like, wow. <laughs> such big pictures in such small tube and when I opened it they were securely wrapped up in this cellophane plastic which I've kept and it was wrapped in for security I mean it wasn't all just stuck in like that it had all some wrapping around it amazing amazing you can tell that this man cares for his work for the fact the way he's posted it and securely sent it so obviously I took them straight out they were a little bit rolled up so I had to leave them for a few days on a flat surface to flatten out. But I just could not wait to put these in frames. And because they're A3 size prints, guys, it was very, very hard to actually find. Um, it was actually hard to find frames for them. So I took two of my um, Anstok pictures out of these frames. I'm now on a mission to find two new frames for them. But I thought this is perfect for this one. So guys, this is one of the pictures that I paid for. This was £13.50. This is an A3 size print. And um, let's just discuss what's going on in this picture. So from what I can see, it is um, what I'd look like some kind of doll's house. Um, very, very gothy looking doll's house. And the lady who stood next to it has a skeleton hand arm and then there's a pumpkin with a knife in it at the bottom i mean they've even got the what's it called the noose or something where it, you, you can hang yourself they've got chains dangling from the wall they've got um, a mirror here and some candles lit here some bats in a cauldron with something going on in there a witchy doll sat there and a skull a black cat and a candle the detail in this picture is amazing i mean even her necklace is a an inverted cross She's got one eye with stitching going down and one gothy looking eye and the other one. I will uh, put this print in the description box so you can grab it if you want to. £13.50. It is well securely packaged, guys. And as you can see, it's a black and white illustration. I think he does more black and white illustrations than anything. Um, the ones that I got before with the four postcards of the pinup girls. Love them, love them, love them. And I just seen this one and I instantly fell in love with it. But I also fell in love with another print, guys. And he, he did say, would you like to, to pick a, a print? And I said, are you 100% are you sure? Because, you know, you know, I, I'm quite happy to pay, pay for it. And he said, no, it's to say thank you. So if you want to pick one. And I picked this one. So, guys, I put this also in a frame for now. Oh, sugar. That made me jump. These are actually going onto my wall tonight. When I'm finished, this frame is a little bit dodgy, guys. Let's give me a minute. It's actually not pinging in properly. I'll just do it like that for now. So this one, guys, is the one that he sent me to say thank you. And oh my God, I love it. So obviously it's um, Wednesday Adams. 
or it's a, a look-alike of Wednesday Adams with 666 written on a forehead she's got a cobweb um, looking forehead here and um, a pentacle star there I love the dots over her eyebrows I like the way her eyes are quite bright vibrant she's got an inverted cross which is very similar to the necklace on the other lady she's got a bee on her neck she's holding a, a candle with a teddy bear tattooed um and it says marcus jones on the bottom of each of these prints guys so you can see that they are done by him <gasps> i am so in love with all these people that do these prints i mean marcus jones i've done hannah horror i've done um i've done Gemma craft studios i think i've done somebody else as well that does art amazing absolutely amazing talent absolute talent i mean i wouldn't know where to start i mean the the details in these pictures are absolutely amazing i will show you her again closer up um again this was 13 pound 50 exactly the same as the print they are same size prints i've just got them in different size frames i've had to fold it slightly at the bottom just to fit it in i'll let you just take that in how beautiful so that is my print to say thank you marcus jones i absolutely love it thank you so so much i can't wait to take a picture of these pictures so that one i'm scared that all this frame is falling apart guys it's it's literally not not staying hooked in i need to get it on the wall asap so that is that one guys and then obviously a hand i just realized you can't see a hand but it's actually around the house and then it's dangling off here so i'll let you just have a look at that print so marcus johns um he is on etsy guys he is on instagram as well and he, i don't think he's on facebook guys but i have found him um if you google marcus johns art all his art comes up he like i said before he does so many he does the crow on there as well lots of um nancy from the craft like the mugshot kind of pictures the jesse as well from breaking bad absolutely amazing um i'm just bowed over by it now this is the packaging that these prints came in this is marcus john's card as well he did put that in the tube it got a little bit bent but i've straightened it out um and his details are actually on there let me just grab this so it's marcus john's art and it's marcus john's at protomail.com it's www.deviantart.com slash marcus jones he has his own website his own art website guys which is that deviant one i will link it down below and he's got a www.etsy.com uk shop marcus jones art and then he's got www.instagram.com screaming demons art i remember that because i did him on there and he's also on pinterest at .co.uk demons art there is his card guys if you want to pause that and take down his details just in case you don't want to mess about with me put it down at the bottom go and check marcus john's art out amazing amazing so guys i did ask him to parcel this one up for me as a gift because this is a gift um i don't think the person i bought this for watches my channel but i did open it to have a look but I am going to glue it back down. So it comes in this black envelope and then he's put the ink on the back of it. The, I forgot what it's called this, but I absolutely love how he's done it. Now my husband said he'll be able to um, sort all that out and get it back down again, get some more ink on there, some wax. He's wax melted it, that's it. But I just had to show you what these look like. I'm going to put that back on there, but here is the postcards oh, this is how they come guys this is how my four came and this is if you order four postcards this is how they'll come i've actually got a note in the back as well um that he's put on for me and then if i just quickly because i did ask him to parcel these up but now thinking about it i'm gonna have to take them out anyway and put them in frames because i want to give them in frames but let me just show you he does put the cardboard on there to secure and stuff him from bending here is this one here let me just lay him out oh my lord i absolutely love these so here is these are the actual pin-up sexy girls guys this present is for a male 
so male part of the family and I just think that he will appreciate these because they're absolutely beautiful they're gothic they're dark and they're sexy with it they're proper zombie pinup girls guys amazing amazing I wish I could do art like this I honestly wish I could I'm going to put them back in there guys until I actually buy because I need to buy some grey frames and these are postcard size guys so they're quite easy to buy frames for guys these I'm going to leave them out for now they are really easy to buy um, frames for these obviously I've got one of mine here and I've got my other three in my living room so pl please please go and check out Marcus Jones art you will not be disappointed guys I think his art is absolutely amazing I love this every penny worth £13.50 I pay a lot more for my Ann Stokes art guys and I mean this is just it's just perfect I love it I'm getting really into the black and white um art at the minute as you know I've bought some from Hannah Hannah Horror and I'm going to be buying some more from Hannah Horror and I definitely 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 will be buying more from Marcus Jones he will he will be dealing with me again that's for sure um but for this for 2020 I think I've got enough prints to last me the rest of this year all right guys take care of yourself happy Halloween and um, thank you Marcus, I absolutely love these. I've got to try and get them back in, back in and drip some of my black um, wax onto there and seal it again. <laughs> Alright guys, take care of yourself and I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell and hit that like button if you like this video because it helps me out and my channel. Take care guys and I'll see you on my next one. Bye for now.